hi guys today is my flight going to vienna and i'm so excited hi good morning so i'm here at cebu international airport and this is my first ever international flight after two years and my first ever international i mean outside asia getaway so yeah i'm very excited and kind of nervous because the flight is quite long so from cebu to dubai and then dubai to vienna so yeah yeah feels like I'm very early. My flight is 5.55 and it's still one exactly one o'clock so it's better to be early than to be late. I don't want to be stressed because the last time I flew I remember going to what's this El Nido. I was running like literally running. Yeah, I don't want to be stressed. While eating, of course, eating is the best. And now checking departure time. Right after is immigration and boarding. At this very moment, I am so excited to see what's inside that big aircraft and of course the food. It's champagne. Champagne is the first thing I see, but for business class. Sana all. Hopefully, maka business class soon. Girl, let's move on to economy. So this is my seat and my screen. snack is hot turkey and cheese gosh this is so good and super hot first stop is clark to disembark and get passengers going to dubai housekeeping aircraft staff something like that are giving like 15 minutes to clean before getting the passengers in and this is the cute aircraft laboratory in a video of course for the vlog this is our dinner, there's rice, I'm so happy, and this is our snack before the plane. Finally here in the bar. Airport Dubai is so huge, but it feels like Manila because there are so many Filipinos and speaking Tagalog. Exploring the airport of Dubai because I still have like seven hour layover. So yeah, let's go And now checking the departure time going to Vienna Let's go another five hours going there And another flying hour for five hours round two and right after takeoff, another snack time, which I really like, and then a little sleep. And then lunch time, well, the food looks really good. And of course, the taste is, let's see. Oh, I'm very happy. The food is really great, except that I miss the rice so much. Finally, after 16 hours of flying, I'm finally here in Europe. I'm finally here in Vienna. This is my first time. I'm so excited to explore, to see everything. And yeah, can't wait to explore. Oh my gosh, so this is, well, just outside the airport. <laughs> Very excited. So this is our room. It's very nice, very cozy, very cute. Hi. And yeah, you have your TV, then the bed, 
me a hug to get my man. So this is the comfort room. Very cute. Mm -hmm. You have your shower room. This, that. And very cute. <laughs> and then outside you have this view. Look at that. Mmm. We. Nadi na ligo dito. Look at that. I can't wait to go down and then run <laughs> or just walk muna or sleep sleep sa maybe one hour or two because I so miss the bed. <laughs> so this is me the next day. I was sleeping the whole night. I think that was 10 hours of sleeping. Like Yesterday I saw children swimming in here like kada pala <laughs> the best thing to explore the place is to run ah, running here in Vienna it's kind of cold but yeah someone has to run because I will eat a lot later <laughs> Kaya bito mag-jogging ka niya, sigira kag, sigira kag stop kay, hindot ka yung view. Where are you? There you go. <laughs> Breakfast buffet here at Courtyard Marriott Hotel. And so far the food is really good but the rice is missing like I so miss you rice jogging done breakfast done now time to explore Vienna let's go hi so we're here at Vienna at st. Stephen's Cathedral Let's go inside the cathedral and at this very area there is no entrance fee yet. To get inside this fence, of course, this time you need to pay. But it's worth to come here because the place is so beautiful and there are so many restaurants around and yeah, many places okay. to see. So nice to be here. Just a few meters away from the cathedral, you will see this beautiful statue. And just a few walks, you will see this St. Peter's Catholic Church. Of course, I have to go in and see what's inside the church. And by the way, there is no entrance fee. Right after St. Peter's, just continue walking maybe around 200 meters and you will see the next 
stop, which is the Half Burj Palace. I don't know what place is this, but it looks big and beautiful. Let's go. Now going back to the cathedral to see my friends, we will pass Michael Kors, Salvatore, Gucci, Fendi, and of course Dior. So just shop if you have the budget. So these are my friends, kind of shy at this moment. We are going to see the colorful houses here in Vienna. I hope we will we'll find it right away because we are taking a lot of walking. See? <laughs> I think this is the colorful apartment, but the one in Instagram is the back let's go so here we go this is one of the tourist highlights here in Vienna look at that there are so many people right now honestly I'm a little disappointed because it's just a building a colorful building and you cannot go in that's it Gutom, something. There's an ice cream, perfect for more cake. Now we are on our way to Nash Market at Bezerg Maria Lift. So we're here at another tourist spot. We're going to the open market here in Vienna. I hope we can find something good food there. Ay pasalubo. Nash 
Nash. What? Nash much. Nash much. Dao. Ganon ka. After walking around for like forever, we finally found a restaurant for dinner. Done at the marketplace. Time for us to go home, and tomorrow let's go to Budapest.